Hello everyone, uh, Order 66 Stop Motion here. Just want to say, uh, I would go over the tutorial for uh, this app. It's called Stop Motion Studio. It's free. There are some in app purchases to get more stuff, but the masking is completely free. So, this is the tutorial. So, you're gonna need some clay. Uh, I sometimes will use like a pencil or a toothpick or something, but we're not gonna be using it for this tutorial so first you're going to want to turn on a light and actually my little setup is really simple it's just like five Legos and then I just put my phone in the middle and then it keeps the camera still so no you see you have to make sure the camera is completely still no just like holding it up because that will make it very choppy and bad Okay, so we are just going to make this guy jump. You're going to want to, uh, if you want something to be like smooth, you want to get like a wind up of sorts so like it looks more like an actual person is doing it instead of he just all of a sudden starts flying kind of. Um, so when you, what do you want to do when you want to start masking? So you just, I just stuck them into some clay, and then just moved the clay around. So you're just going to want to have the him go either up, how far, or how far you want him to jump. I'm just going to have him jump off the screen for no real reason, just because. Um, so you're going to have him just keep going. You can use your hands, but you'll have to get rid of the shadow later. So here's what you have to do. You have to take a blank picture of what the background is, because you have to keep the camera still to make it easy. So you just copy it and then go to the first frame where the clay appears and just paste it and then click erase and then you'll just have to draw around the clay um, sometimes the floor or it will be a, different, a little different so you're just gonna have to color around it to make it make it a little more natural but if it was good and the lighting was a bit better you wouldn't have to do that I would suggest using like two lamps instead of just the one that I'm using right now. So you just keep going to every frame and just erase all around and make sure it looks smooth because sometimes you'll erase like see right there a little part of his leg. You don't want to leave that in. And also there's a plus eraser in case you like mess something up and you don't want to just do the undo button so it basically gets rid of your erasing so when you have to get rid of, if you're just picking it up and your hand's kind of in the way of the light, you'll have to erase the shadow if you want it to make it uh, just not look like there's a hand in front of the light. You see all this, you just kind of just get rid of it. See, it looks like it was never there. And now you delete all of the frames that were just empty and when you are done it should look like he just jumps off the screen it's obviously this one's obviously not the smoothest of all I could have just taken more time and did better lighting went slower so when you want to export a movie you click select, click on your project, and then click export movie. I go to save video because it, you can, it just saves to your photos app. 
Also, uh, I'm pretty sure Stop Motion Studio is on Android too. And here I just get rid of some clay that was stuck inside the minifigures because you don't want to get ruin their feet so they can't walk anymore. So we are going to um ooh. we are going to just make a simple little blaster shot. So we grab uh I use this just like lightsaber laser and this blue thing that I found. And you just gotta kinda wanna move it around. I just, I started it where like the top part isn't even on. So it, I think it would kinda look like it would like form as it's firing. So you just kinda wanna move it. Closer and closer till it hits him. And then I used, I just took off the, uh, I, after this frame, I just take off the lightsaber part and I just attach it with some clay. And then I just get a little uh, red stud and just put it on with clay again. Now let's see what that looks like. Without the masking it looks obviously a little strange because, you know, so we just take a frame that's completely empty and then like that. Oops. And the like that, it's look, it was never even there. Also, this footage is sped up 300% mostly. I, I turn it down when, when it's like actually like watching it. Okay, so looks pretty good. I uh, I'm gonna change the frame, erase this a little bit because it looked a little weird because I had erased it in all of the other frames because of the clay. So that is the end of the video thank you for watching